Hi guys and welcome back on my YouTube channel. As always, I hope you are doing great. Today in my review, our good old buddy, the iPhone 10 or the iPhone X. Is this smartphone is still hot in 2021 and 2022? Is this iPhone still an iconic device? For how long it will be supported by Apple? Should you buy it? Should you keep it if you already have it in your possession? I will try to answer all your questions here, so let's go! My iPhone 10 is refurbished and certified by Apple 256GB white version that I bought on Apple.com. To find refurbished iPhones certified by Apple, just go to Apple.com and at the bottom of the web page you will find refurbished section, it's 30-40% to off and it's a brand new devices with Apple warranty and everything. Anyway, I purchased mine on December of 2020, almost two and a half years after it was originally released by Apple. I decided to go with 256GB version because I'm always running low on storage and I hate it. 256GB is great. I can film in 4K and I can download any type of games and apps and I have huge photo library with all my pictures from 1997. So what I love about this phone is Face ID Unlock, it works fast and it's very secure. It has a gorgeous OLED panel that is very color accurate. I just love this screen and by the way it's the same display that you will find on the latest iPhone 12 Pro. Nothing has changed since 2017. It supports latest iOS 14 and iOS 15 versions and I suppose that it will be supported up to iOS 19, so up to 2024 or even up to 2025. You see Apple supported iPhone 6 for almost 7 years and processors nowadays are so powerful that they can handle future versions of iOS pretty easy. Anyway, I think this phone will have a long life and if you can buy it today for a low price, so just go for it. You will be happy, especially if you are using an old iPhone. Personally, I will be using it until the end of its life cycle or until the day Apple will make a new next generation iPhone. Because even the iPhone 12 Pro, it's the same iPhone, it's the same iPhone 10, but with better cameras and better performance. But you know, you won't be able to feel it in day-to-day -day usage, I mean, the iPhone 10 is better, but it's way more pricey. I will recommend you to buy only big storage capacity iPhones, because you will be able to fully enjoy your device, and by the way, 256GB version is faster than 64GB, I know, that's funny, but it's true. So always stick with a bigger storage iPhone, it will last you longer and will be cheaper on a long term basis. The iPhone 10 is very fast and it's fully enough for my daily usage. I'm filming my YouTube videos on it in 4K and it's still running nice and smooth. My battery health is 98% because technically it's still a new phone it's just six months old. I'm using wireless charging and all the features that it offers. And trust me, it's still a very modern phone. You can still play some heavy games on it, you can watch YouTube videos, literally it will handle any task you wish. It uses dual camera system and it's capable of filming in 4K 60 frames per second. It is capable of filming in slow motion as well. It's more than enough for a regular person, but I should say that the iPhone 12 Pro has this nice wide-angle camera and it's better, but only if you are filming videos. The iPhone 10 cameras are still great for a regular user. All the apps are running super fast on this iPhone, it works fine with my Apple Watch SE and my AirPods Pro. The iPhone 10 uses Bluetooth 5.0 low energy and its battery life is quite good for my usage and my battery is almost new, so you know. Web browsing is super smooth and fast. I love how it looks and I love the stainless steel material and its glass back. It reminds me of my old iPhone 4 and 4S and by the way, I have a review on my channel, so check it out if you're interested in. My iPhone 10 is in perfect condition, I'm always using cases and generally I'm really caring about my devices, so it will last me longer. 
I think the iPhone 10, even in 2021 and 2022, is still a great value smartphone. It has old features and it's, it's an iconic device. I hope this iPhone will have a long life in my pocket and it will be giving me joy and happiness every day, at least up to 2025. So you can love or hate this smartphone and it's notch, but it's still here at least for the next 4 to 5 years up to 2025. Thanks for watching, I hope you liked this video and my quick look up. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel for more videos in the future. Thanks again and as always have a nice day. Bye bye.